I'm going to speculate and say that despite the 5-2 defeat today, you might have seen a few things out on the pitch that pleased you today. Very much. Would, would, would it be right? Very yeah. much so. Very much so. You know what I'm like to, to take in positives out of things and um, certainly took a great heart from the way we kept on trying to play. Um, two early goals were could have been devastating but they kept they kept going the lads you know when on another day we, we, we had many we heard you know that goes in and it, it kept on so it changes of the game but um everything's meant to be in it it's one of them even to the to the point that um although i wouldn't say we were unlucky in any way shape or form but plays its part and the times where they scored goals were absolutely devastating and yeah. sickening. You know, you're just thinking, right, we're getting a foothold. And, you know, teams of Ashton's quality, which is, you know, immense, really. I mean, I know the majority of their players, two or three, three of the players, they had a FC United playing in the Conference North. So I know the, the level of quality that they've got and the type of people and the, and the players they are. And obviously, Steve, Steve Cunningham, you know, being a, a fantastic manager, and you know, we 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 stay at the same place, and we see the, the kind of training that, that they're kind of going through, as as we are, as we are. It was funny, I said to him, the first goal. I've watched them do that on Thursday yeah. night. Um, I'm watching them do it. You don't really think you're gonna. Well, you, you, you look to set up to it, but it was um, it was actually just a, a minute of the movement and getting a ball in, great ball in, and, and a great header. You know, the first two goals were fantastic from um, from their point of view. You know, what if we go really picky and analytical? Then you know, we positionally we, we need to do things a little bit quicker. That that's one of the things that have taken out of, you know an area for us for us to improve is is we need to start travelling harder and, and, and quicker when the ball's travelling. I think sometimes we, we, we wait to see where it's going and then they can't move. We need to start being a bit more proactive um, in that respect, especially against good sides uh, because they hurt you, uh, as we've seen. And then, the, you know, the second half, um, I think we've scored a, a great goal. I'm going to laugh with Jerome because um, they, they put Tom Denton on who is possibly, you know, he jumps in knock himself out on somebody who floodlights is that big. Um, so I, I don't know how he's got it up and down to be honest. Mm -hmm. um, but a great great free kick. Um, and then they go down the other end and, and you know they, as a game and as as looking at other teams and, and where we want to be. When we get in the final third sometimes I think we can be trying to sometimes a little bit too intricate or we're not decisive enough with with our final pass. Um, whereas you know, you're playing against teams from a higher level at the top of that division, by the way, and they get into the final third and there's something at the end of it, whether that be a cross, a shot, um, a goalkeeper save, or even a goal kick, you know, they, they, there's an endeavour. Um, and we've got that, and um, we just need, need to start producing it more, but it, it, it's really stark when you see it um, with the two teams that are, are, you know, from, yeah. from the different levels. Because I think they didn't used to be um, that much of a of a step up in, in these divisions from the West to Premier League. I think that's, that's really taken us now. We've really taken us now. Yeah. You've, you've been here nearly 12 months now, amazingly, as manager. And we've, we've definitely learned that you're the sort of person in life and in football where you can learn lessons all the time, whatever stage of life that you're at, you can always learn things. And what, you, what you're describing there is lessons that we can, we can learn from this, things we can pick up on and work on ourselves afterwards. Yeah. Massively, massively, that's what it that's what life is. It's all a lesson, it's all it's all learning, you know, and you know making the four substitutions. I think we probably a little bit of surprise at the four substitutions, but we need to see things. These lads who have been have been patient, you know, the game was, was pretty much dead and gone, you know, I, I can be I can be unrealistic and say, Oh, I think we can try and get back into it, you know, and be deluded like that. But, it's not, it's not in me, so it, it, was, it was important that we got um, all five substitutes a, a decent run out and, and gave them. And, and you know, having made, made the change, thought we scored a, a great goal. Um, it's you know, see Rob Worrell, who, who we all know is an absolutely fantastic player, and, and you know, we, 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 if we can get him into the areas and work the ball to, to, to Rob's advantage, he, he can unlock defences, and he, you know, he did that. And a, a great finish for young Kanye as well. Um, going on, so loads and loads of positives, um, and you know uh, another positive is looking at the league results. They they've kind of gone our way, so um, you know we, we we stay 
in and around in and around that. We're still on that quest for the 40 point mark. Um, but you know, it, it, it's great that we've we've come so far. I think the type of football that we're playing um, is a really enjoyable one. Um, uh, you know, I kind of get that feedback definitely from the players that they're enjoying it. There's, is there lots that we can improve on? Always. Yeah, yeah. Always. I mean, from a spectator's point of view, we just said that it was a really enjoyable game to watch, um, and the entertainment factor is important. Um, we've got Mosley on on Tuesday evening, so uh, as you say, we're, we're still level on points at, at the top of the league. There's a long way to go, but I think if, if we can get a victory on Tuesday night, you're halfway towards your 40 point. Well, there you go. Target, there you so. go. So I'll, I'll, I'll definitely, I'll definitely be using that. You know, it's um, it's great within within that 12 months, which has been absolutely fantastic. There've been lots of changes. Um, the support that, I, that that I've had and we've had from from the board it, it's been fantastic. You know everything that we, we've kind of asked for, um, and we all, have, as we know, we're, we're moving forward. We're making great strides off the pitch. Um, we've coordinated now to have a reserve team that's producing players that are, are coming through. They've won 31 today. The youth team have gone and um, beaten uh, a, 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 a Southport away you know a, a conference yeah. north yeah. team you know so everything everything is, is kind of taking taking place obviously everybody looks to, to the first team pitch and, and the, the uneducated ones will be looking at 5-2 and, and uh, something um, I don't know down about it yeah. um, I can certainly assure you that that's not the case in, in, in my mind or in any of your players mind you know they do they walk away from here with, with nothing but some of that Okay, right. Cheers, Carl. Thanks. See you on Tuesday. See you Tuesday. <laughs>